Never in Venice without a visit to the Rialto fish market. Starting with the vegetable part, I will get over to the, the fish part later. So many temptation. I wish I had a kitchen here where I could cook. It's around noon now and um, the fish market will soon close down for the day. It opens very early in the morning. It's still busy but now mostly with uh, tourists and still a few locals to buy fish for their lunch or tonight's dinner. In summer it's always very busy here. So I don't know if it is because it's late in the day or maybe it is more quiet now in March. Because I'm surprised there are so few boots now. Only a few fishermen selling their goods. Sometimes I find uh, salmon from Norway here. I will have some fish food for lunch today. This tempts me. From the fish market, there is only a short walk over to Mauro's studio. Mauro, the glass artist, which is a very good friend of mine. And that's where I'm heading now. Over to see if Mauro is in his studio. Can you see this red house? In the huge window there is uh, Mauro's, behind the window is Mauro's workshop. Now I'm curious to see if he is there. Yes, there is light inside. Then he is in there working. <laughs> he saw me through the window. So here he is, I think he's having a workshop, teaching people to work with glass. It seems like Mauro yes, is busy, yes, yes. <laughs> he's busy having a workshop <laughs> in his studio, teaching people to make glass art. You can't understand it because now explain you to you this. <laughs> it seems like I came just in time for lunch. Mauro is taking his two students out to have pizza 
and I was asked to come with them, which I said yes to, of course. Pizza with Mauro, Mauro is always wonderful.